Welcome back to 100 Days of Hunger Games, and I'm Amber James. What are we explaining this week? Well, here it is. The capital. The capital of Pan Am is where the most wealthy and powerful people of the nation reside. While most of the districts are scraping to get by, the citizens of the capital bathe in luxury, eccentric style, and expensive eats. Before the dark days, the districts were brought together under the capital's rule, thus forming the nation of Pan Am. The districts tried to rebel against the capital, but lost hope once the outermost District 13 was supposedly destroyed by the capital forces. The capital now serves as the hub for the dictatorship run by President Snow, aka the godfather of Pan Am, who won't flinch at using violence to keep his foes silent. Now he uses the Hunger Games to serve as a reminder to the remaining 12 districts that they lost the rebellion. So aside from the makeup and the cool colored skin, the capital folks are not your friends. Got that? Don't trust anyone in the capital. What do you think about the capital? Be sure to tweet me and stay tuned for the next installment of the Hunger Games Encyclopedia. Plus, come back to Celeb Buzz tomorrow for more 100 Days of Hunger Games.